All right, our focus on mental health has increased since the pandemic, and a new app developed by doctors at Yale is helping people get even more in touch with how we feel. It's even won an award. And to tell us more, we are joined by Dr. Mark Brackett, a psychologist and part of the How We Feel Project. He's also the founding director of Yale's Center for Emotional Intelligence and a professor at the university. That's quite the resume, Doc. <laughs> Good morning, and thanks for joining Thank us. Thank you. It's great to be here. How do you feel? How do I feel? Yeah. Well, you know, I'm, I just ran in here. It's raining outside. I'm a little nervous, but I'm excited. Not so. only nervous. <laughs> hey, this is a great thing. Congratulations. Really I appreciate yeah. that. No, Thank it really you. is we're, terrific. We're super excited about it. How long was the process? So the co-founder of Pinterest, Ben Silver, and I met uh, a couple of years ago, and we just decided to work together with our respective teams to build this app to help people build their emotion language and to learn strategies to help them deal with their feelings. And Which how is does this app actually work, like the insides of it? Yeah, so uh, it's a combination of science and a lot of creativity. Um, the first thing that you do is you check in with your feelings. So what we find in our research is that most people are, you know, well, let me ask you, how are you feeling? Uh, I'm feeling pretty good today. I got a lot of sleep yesterday, so okay. I'm actually energized and ready to go. And how about for you? I'm feeling also very energized. Got a little bit of sleep. <laughs> yeah, we, well, for her, she's got two young kids, so it's a little <laughs> yeah. bit more difficult for her. You it's know, funny because uh, you were saying checking in with your feelings really quick. I just wanted to mention my son, he goes to preschool, and they have a board when they walk into the classroom. The first thing, they have to basically identify how, how they, they feel, feel with yeah. all of these adjectives. Um, that's probably our work, which is in half of Connecticut schools, amazing. by the way. Amazing. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah. But um, so the app starts with checking in with your feelings. We have 144 emotions with it, their definitions. Is it? It's a free app. It's free. Okay. Uh, made generous. Uh, made free because of generous donations. That's wonderful. And um, and then once you kind of check in with your feelings, then you can decide. Well, do I want to shift how I'm feeling? Do I want a strategy to help me deal with my feelings? And we've got over 30 research-based strategies to support people in changing the way they think. Maybe they reach out to somebody. Maybe they do a breathing exercise. Just lots of strategies that fit all kinds of um, people's interests. No. Yeah, I'm going to my therapist at two today, so like I'm checking in with him. But this is, uh, if you don't have your own personal therapist, yeah. this is, might be a great resource to use. You know, my belief is that everyone needs an emotion education. Everyone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm and, completely uh, with you. We all need to be yeah. in touch with our emotions. And so this tool is a, a free uh, tool to help people build those skills. Would you say that this is also, um, it's so inclusive, it seems, because it's literally making you take a pause and see how you're feeling. Because in this day and age, we're so busy. We're go, 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 go. You know, we have screens in front of us, but this is such a wonderful platform where you can kind of let people, you know, in on how they're actually feeling in that moment. Well, what's great about it is that, you know, oftentimes we only think about how we're feeling when we're experiencing strong, unpleasant feelings, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. I'm anxious, I'm depressed. But you can set reminders on this app. And so you can do it two or three times a day. And then you realize, you know what? Right now I'm feeling super excited. Or, you know, I'm feeling content or tranquil or peaceful. And uh, I think it gives people a better kind of um, a larger picture of their emotional life. What was it like meeting the the owner, the founder of Pinterest? It founder was fantastic. You know, I was very fortunate. I wrote a book that came out called Permission to Feel. And he had read the book and had a lot of uh, aligned interest in emotional literacy and emotional well-being and you know we just decided to collaborate and take our respective uh, skills and put them together and build something Because I have about. a call later with Elon, Elon Musk but I don't, I, don't, <laughs> I don't think he's going to take the call. I just don't think that I could have that kind of rapport with him. <laughs> he's too busy trying to pay the rent, the back rent <laughs> on some is, of the buildings. There you go. Um, so this app, I mean, it sounds amazing, and it is so amazing that it also has garnered some awards. Yes. How did you feel when you found out that you won that Cultural Impact Award for 2022? You know, it was fantastic because we got to fly out to Apple headquarters. We met the CEO of Apple. Wow. We got, uh, oh. just we got to, uh, <laughs> yeah, there you go. I'm sorry. What are you going to do? I love it. I love it. <laughs> Keep going. Uh, and we just met other creative people actually really fun thing one of my former students won all, won an award also which oh, is just amazing. saw and um, you know I think what's important is that it just gives us that opportunity to, to scale it you know we because we made it available for free we also want as many people as possible to use it yeah mm -hmm. exactly. so any kind of recognition like this is really um, fantastic because it just gets more people access to it. Okay Are you, is it gonna be available for Android as well as within about a month oh good Great. yes 
Oh, okay. so this is perfect timing with the new year. Yep. Awesome. Uh, well, thank you so much, Dr. Mark Braga, for joining us. We feel even better after talking with you. <laughs> yeah, you've got great hair. I appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> we are really getting in check in touch, in our touch with our today. feelings today. It's I want to emote here. All right.